in a few seconds, this car will start um, racing. Pay close attention. The car travels the same speed the whole time, even though that doesn't really happen in real life. Anyway, on your marks, get set, go. That was exciting. Now, how fast was the car going? If you couldn't tell, don't worry. Let's race again. This time, we'll time it. Remember, the car goes the same speed the whole time. How long does it take? Ready, set, go. Okay, so how long did it take? I got five seconds. But five seconds isn't a speed. So how fast was the car going? If you need one more time, here you go. This time we'll show the beginning and ending distance. Okay, last time. Ready, set, go. If the car went the same speed the whole time, how fast did it go? You probably figured out that knowing the time wasn't enough. And just knowing how far the car went, its distance, isn't enough either. To talk about the speed of the car, we need both distance and time in a ratio. This ratio, 440 feet in 5 seconds, is a special kind of ratio called a rate. But you can simplify this rate just like you simplify any ratio, though you have to keep track of the units. When you simplify this rate so that the denominator is 1, you'll make a unit rate. This will tell you how many feet per second the car traveled. Finally, we'll know the car's speed. <laughs>